Coming up next, it's the marvelous misadventures of Flatjack on Cartoon Network. Coming up next, it's the marvelous misadventures of Flatjack on Cartoon Network. It's the marvelous misadventures of Flapjack next on Boomerang. Up next, it's an all new Flapjack on Cartoon Network. <laughs> and great deals at Gaspacho's. What goes better with adventures than barrels of sweet, sweet candy? Individual candy's not for sale. Ahoy! It's a pile of sardines! I have no idea what these are worth. Wash them fishies down with smooth and delicious maple syrup. What do you say, Captain? <laughs> oh, and I know it. For you beardless wonders, we have Slippery Peach Whisker Elixir, half off. Made from real eel goo. 
That's disgusting. Moving on. Need a hand? I'll give you one. That is, I'll give you two for one. Because when it comes to deals, you gotta hand it to gazpacho. Ah! Huh? For you junior adventurers, we got just what you need. Sailor caps, beards, eye patches, one for each eye, peg legs, you name it. Good luck there, kid. Gazpachos for random stuff you can't find anywhere else. Look for our new Stormalong Harbor location off Dock 5. <laughs> The foot burn. The foot burn is a painful medical condition afflicting your lower extremities. Wilkis' is medicated foot cream relieves symptoms associated with the foot burn. Symptoms like redness, burning, itching, smoke, sizzling sounds. This is serious. Serious. Well kisses relieve symptoms on contact, eradicating most, if not all, conditions overnight. Well kisses are the only cure for foot burn. Well kisses are the only cure for foot burn, and they're available now for just 99 pence. 99 pence. 99 pence. Well kisses medicated foot cream. Act now and receive this 99 pence ship with tiny bottles in it. Never mind. What? Wait, where are you going? Let's be friends! <laughs> Welcome to Storm Along, where everyone's rough and tough and ready for adventures! Meet the most adventurous adventurer that ever ventured forth on the seven seas. I'm Flapjack. He's ready to take on the world, and he's bringing a few friends along for the ride. Ah, she blows! Captain Carnacles, adventurer extraordinaire, and the worst best friend a boy could have. Captain Carnacles, you're the most amazing adventurer ever! Uh, how about you go in first? Adventure? Adventure. And Bubby, the fastest ship that's not a ship beyond the waves. Look at that whale, spying on other people all day. Together, they're going to get seriously weird. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All a handful. Ah! Don't get in any more trouble. Wow, you can drive a trolley? Can I drive a trolley? presents a whale of a tale about a boy, his friend, and his, uh, whale. Oh, baby! Oh, Bobby! Oh! The Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack premieres Thursday at 8.30. That's sort of the most amazing story that's ever happened to anybody. Only on Cartoon Network. See you around. Bye! Take care! See you next time! We had fun! Bye! This is the world of Stormalong Harbor. A place where only the toughest, strongest, and ugliest can survive. Hi, friend. Want to have some adventures? Flapjack is ready to take on the world. And he's bringing a few friends along for the ride. Yay! The Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack. Premiering Thursday, June 5th at 8.30. Hi, friend. My name's Flapjack. I was pretty lonely and 
so I met the knuckles of Bobby. The knuckles is only the greatest adventure ever. When he chases luck. To the left, then. He's a great pal. What? See anything? Nope, just garbage. Bobby watches out for him. We have lots of adventures. Looks like fun, doesn't it? The Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack, premiering Thursday, June 5th at 8.30. Only on Cartoon Network. Flapjack is ready to take on the world, and he's bringing a few friends along for the ride. Yay! The Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack, premiering Thursday, June 5th at 8.30. Only on Cartoon Network. Hello there. I'm Captain Knuckles. I'm an adventurer. Yeah, so am I. Not the boy so much. Have I ever told you the story of the time I single-handedly saved Flapjack from certain death? Uh, how about you go in first? Adventure? Well, maybe later. All I know is the kid has a long way to go, but I'll get him there. <laughs> the Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack, premiering Thursday, June 5th at 8.30, only on Cartoon Network. This is the worst birthday ever! West! Oh, look, Martha. Tandem Travelers. West! <laughs> Do you want a french fry? An all new Flapjack, tonight at 8.30. Adventure! Only on Cartoon Network. The most cutthroatinist, beard havinist, tattooinist, <laughs> candy lovinist port on the seven seas. I want to go there. This Sunday, it's the entire first season of Flapjack. <laughs> that is the weirdest town I have ever seen. <laughs> it's all 13 episodes of Flapjack, Sunday at noon, only on the Cartoon Network. Hey, how about this pizza fresh fruit? 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 Fresh fruit. Nature's way of preventing scurvy. Fruit! Yeah! An all-new flapjack tonight at eight thirty. Part of our heart our days. Only on Cartoon Network. Has this ever happened to you? Captain, the dog's on fire! Wait a sec! No, boy! We got the foot burn! Amazing Whale Kisses Medicated Foot Cream kills foot burn fast. An all new Flapjack. <laughs> Thursday night at 8 30. <laughs> Only on Cartoon Network. So I thought we'd start with an easy tickle game to break the ice. Whoever giggles first loses. <laughs> you win. An all new Flapjack. Thursday night at 8.30. <laughs> Only on Cartoon Network. Do you like world famous comedy? Monday <laughs> nights. Uh, what? Something new. Something great. <laughs> I hope you guys save some room for comedy. <laughs> Brand new episodes are headed your way. Ah, new territory. New marvelous misadventures of Flapjack. Monday nights at 8.30, only on Cartoon Network. Okay, everybody, listen. Thursday nights are getting better. First, we start with our friend Chowder. Brand new episodes. Delicious. Then we've got a brand new series. With this guy. Concerning pirates. It's the marvelous misadventures of Flapjack. This boy is crazy. After that, another new show. It's called Total Drama Island. Meet our 22 contestants. There can only be one winner. Then a boy. He's called his sister, Johnny Test. He fights the bad guy. Thursday night just got much better. When, when you're, you're watching our hard hard day. Thursday night today, it's starting. Only on your Cartoon Network. Days. Still the best place for brand new funny. New Johnny Test. We're a hit! New Chowder. You ready to go do your thing? <laughs> new Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack. Wow! The Candy Island! Always funny. Always new. Har Har Thursdays. Thursday starting at 8. Only on Cartoon Network.
Thursdays, still the best place for brand new funny, new children, new marvelous misadventures of Love Jack, new total drama action, new stone. Always funny. I love it. Always new. Ha ha Thursdays. Thursday starting at 8. Only on Cartoon Network. Coming soon. Escape from Cami Island. Featuring music by the barber and his sweepers. He's gonna eat us, Flappy. Look at those slid ass. The flaky sky. Salt water damage. An all new Flapjack. Thursday night at 8.30. <laughs> Only on Portland. Captain Knuckles, are you smarter than a piece of driftwood? Okay, sailor. Show me the difference between your left and your right. Left. My right? An all new Flapjack, Thursday night at 8.30. <laughs> Only on Cultural Network. I'm wise with life lessons. So I thought we'd start with an easy tickle game to break the ice. Whoever giggles first loses. <laughs> you win. An all new Flapjack, Thursday night at 8.30. <laughs> Only on Cultural Network. Ladies and gentlemen, Pancake. I wish I could give this day a hug. Balls. <laughs> How are we supposed to get home? In our big fat donkey ball. See? Did somebody say bone to two? An all new Flapjack, Thursday night at 8.30. <laughs> Only on Cartoon Network. Adventure! <laughs> he reads the future while lesser men read comic books. His turban smells like funnel cakes. He knows the answer to your question before you ask it. But he prefers that you ask it anyway. He is the most intriguing mechanical genie in the world. Do you know where Candied Island is? No. Yes. Maybe. An all new Flapjack, tonight at 8.30. Adventure! Only on Portal Network. Okay, everybody, listen. Thursday nights are getting better. First, we start with our friend Chowder. Then we've got a brand new series. It's the marvelous misadventures of Blackjack. This boy is crazy. After that, another new show. It's called Total Drama Island. Then a boy is called his sister. Johnny Dent fights the bad guy. Thursday nights just got much better. When you're watching our on Thursday. Thursday nights at 8, it's starting. Only on your Cartoon Network. Brought to you by McDonald's Happy Meal. An excellent source of happiness.
Oh boy, those flapjacks look dumb to eat like... Stop! You can't eat flapjacks without maple syrup! I didn't know! Don't let this happen to you. Learn about the dangers of not using maple syrup. No syrup, no flapjacks. It's that simple. Get this boy some syrup! An all-new flapjack, tomorrow night at 8.30. Part of Har Har Thursdays, only on Cartoon Network. Oh, boy! Those flapjacks look dumb to eat like... Stop! You can't eat flapjacks without maple syrup! I didn't know! Don't let this happen to you. Learn about the dangers of not using maple syrup. No syrup, no flapjacks. It's that simple. Get this boy some syrup! An all-new flapjack, tomorrow night at 8.30. Part of Har Har Thursdays, only on Cartoon Network. And now here he is, the famous Yankee Clipper himself, Jolton Joe DiMaggio. Life has taught me to just try and be the best that I can be. And I, I thank the Academy for saying to me that on this given night, I was the best that I could be. Dude! Spend this President's Day weekend with the dudes that make Cartoon Network the coolest place to hang. Hosted by who else? The dudes. The Dudes, The Dudes, Make It Happen Weekend, starting Saturday, February 13th at 10, only on Cartoon Network. Dude! Cartoon Network is throwing a party unlike anything you've ever seen. This time, I'm wearing shorts. <laughs> it's Spring Break Hotel. Awesome party, dudes! Two weeks of our best shows, plus premieres and sneaks of new shows. Let's trash it and throw a party! It's too much TV goodness to keep down. Wow. Spring Break 010, more like Spring Break Oh Yeah! Wrong on so many levels. Spring Break 010, starting next week at 8 on Cartoon Network. Done! Hey, where'd all the new funny go? Get your brand new comedies now on Mondays. New Tony Tess. We are really good secret agents. New Adventure Time. Princess Bubble comes in trouble! New Flapjack. We're free! New Chowder. Chowder! Woo new 16. Uh huh. That's right. Oh, yeah. Get your brand new comedies. Starting April 5th at 7 30. Only on Cartoon Network. Hey, where'd all the new funny go? Get your brand new comedies now on Mondays. New Johnny Test. We are really good secret agents. New Adventure Time. This bubble comes in trouble. New Flapjack. <laughs> new Chowder. Chowder. New 16. Uh -huh. That's right. Get your brand new comedies. Monday night at 7.30. Only on Cartoon Network. I have to go potty in the bathroom. Imagine a land where candy, maple syrup, and talking whales are the only things that matter in life. It's The Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack, Volume 1, for the first time on DVD. Yeah, candy! Sales of Flapjack and the Storm Along Gang in five marvelous adventures. Adventures! Boatloads of special features, including adventures in voice acting, misadventures in song, and more. <laughs> oh, boy, don't miss Flapjack, Volume 1, on DVD. In stores now. Hi, I'm Thurup. I'm the creator of Flapjack. I'm Flapjack. And the voice of Flapjack. Uh, I'm just going to talk a little bit about the development of Flapjack and how it all came about, how it um, became a show. Flapjack! I went to school at CalArts for animation uh, after a few years of just adventuring around and stuff. When I was 13, I was going to run away from home and live off the land on this island. In old Z times, that's what people did. You're 12, you're 13, you go off to sea. Adventure! I don't know, it seemed a perfectly normal idea to me, I guess. Went to Shell Island. Uh, it was a mess getting there. I got stuck out in the middle of this channel with sharks um, in the middle of the night with no paddle, trying to dig paddle through the water. That didn't work. Paddled a surfboard across. All my stuff got soaked. I starved. There were snakes everywhere. Um, speared a manta ray. I couldn't eat it. I opened it. It looked like an alien. Ew. Sea urchins I opened up. I, I knew you can eat sea urchins. I just couldn't do it. Ew. 
I don't know. It was a mess. <laughs> so I just laid there at night, sunburned, starving, cold, and I thought, This is the worst adventure ever! How long did that go on? So that was three days. <laughs> But then I realized, like, especially when I started reading these stories again, like, oh, these are the adventure stories. They didn't plan any of this bad stuff that happened to them. I'm keeping a diary about it. It was exciting. It was a story to tell. I love to do art, so I was kind of trying to make a living doing illustration. Got a job at a video game company and really got into the animation. It was the funnest job I'd ever had. And so after, like, five years, I finally focused on what I wanted to do. I wanted to work in animation, so I went to CalArts. And then I kind of focused down on, I want to make this adventure show, and just started, like, doodling and daydreaming of, like, what's my perfect show. And so this painting over here is probably my first flapjack art, um, where I was starting to lock down my ideas of, like, this adventure. Uh, all these old drawings of flapjack as I was developing them. That's something I did in high school. And I just found it the other day. I thought it was super. Uh, these are little doodles of like the first flapjacks and kind of how we evolved. I love these drawings. I like, I love that one's one of my favorites. Here's some really ugly, really old ones. Boops. My earlier flapjacks, he just had this like messy hair. It was hard to tell a story with just a kid exploring stuff and no one to interact with. And so um, that's how Knuckles kind of came about. I found something, boy. I think it's a map to Candy Island. Someone to clash and get them into trouble. And, and, and the relationships kind of designed getting them into trouble. And then Bubby. Bubby! Flapjack. You know if I don't get my beauty sleep, I get those nasty barnacles under my eyes. I thought of her like Goliath from Davy and Goliath. Oh, I don't know, Flapjack. It seems like a bad idea. Just someone to help illustrate what a bad idea, what a bad situation they're getting into and kind of be a narrator. Quiet, boy, I'm thinking. Then why is your brain so quiet? Because he doesn't have one. This is the life, eh, Flapjack? A belly full of candy, an adventure around every corner. Uh, Brian Doyle Murray um, is who I always wanted for Knuckles. And then actually for Knuckles, we casted someone else for the pilot, but it was not the same show. I'm a way better adventurer than any of these beefcakes. Ha <laughs> ha, no, Flapjack. That's not adventure. Steve Little, um, one of our writers, does Dr. Barber. <laughs> yeah. I, I think I asked for all these accents, like, oh, kids love accents. Steve got it, and he's just like, I, I can't do this. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Wait! But it's hilarious. We all just rolled laughing when we heard it. And you want something? Hold on. <laughs> like... After the storyboard's all done, we go down and record um, in the voice record room. Okay, moving on. Um, hopefully we're all in there together, and then we can interact with each other and play off each other's reads and stuff. Hey, that's a great idea! Why don't you just run up all those stairs? Huh? Oh, yeah. Everyone will get a script, everyone will get the storyboard, and then they'll just read through the script. Uh, I don't know where my script is. No! Um, but without fail, we always, like, no matter how good we think it is in the record, we always realize, oh, shoot, they missed the joke. Um, and, and sometimes we miss the joke. Oh, I didn't even realize that was a joke. Oh, shoot. And so we have to go back and get... Uh, Get pickups. Hey, Thor, can you give us three uh, wows in a row? A number one? Wow! <laughs> like, wow. We'll, we'll disagree on stuff, but somewhere between us is, is where the direction of the show is and the voice of the show. And, and we're all close enough that even if it's not what I would have done, JG will do it funny. And, and same with JG. Like, if I'm doing it, a lot of times he'll be like, oh man, I thought it was going to be like this. But then uh, when he sees the final, he's like, oh yeah, that is funny. I, I don't know, we all have a little bit different sensibilities, but we're all enough on the same page that it's smooth. Really? Of course! Now come on, I'll show you how a real adventurer gets his portrait painted. Flapjack! What? So, uh, we start off an episode uh, with the outline, which is like a usually two-page summary of this is what happened. Ideally, it's it's funny in the outline form, but the main thing is that it tells a strong story. And then the board artists get it, and since on this show they're really involved with the process, 
usually they already know what made them laugh in the story room and so they try to recreate that. So then animatics are after we've recorded the voice actors, we put the storyboard together with <clears throat> the voices and kind of beat out the timing. Excuse me, young boy on the whale, what harbor is this? <laughs> and one of the funnest parts of the process, because you get to see it all together. So then it goes to design phase, the character designers take the storyboards and do like nice drawings of it so that they can be colored and stuff. But I'm really funny about really sticking to the storyboard because your first rough drawings are usually the funniest. And then BGs are designed at the same time, color, color paint. Um, and so little of what we do is done digitally. People, the kids, uh, fans always ask me, oh, what programs do you use? But it's really all done. Uh, we animate by hand, we draw, draw with pencils just like they did 50 years ago. It's weird. And we use computers to edit and to color things, not our background paintings, but I don't know, really we just use computers to put it all together. We're pretty, pretty tight in that group, I think. I don't think it's very common for everyone to be so involved in the process, but it's awesome. It's like a big, happy family friendship. Then at the end, uh, we get the music, we get the sound effects, uh, uh, and then uh, we get to do a mix, and it's usually at night, and, and that's when Jackie and I, um, she's one of the writers, um, will sing the songs, like the angel sound effects, like, Two pieces of candy. which Jackie actually sings. I think the thing that I hate most about do <laughs> doing these songs is because you can't practice, we're on such a tight schedule, you can't really practice, but then I'll do a line and everyone's just like, <sighs> No, can you just hit it? Can you just hit that, hit a note? Um, uh, and, and they'll just be <laughs> so unencouraging. It's rough, like. Into the air, into the air. And I never know what's gonna come out. I, and I think that's why flapjack songs are funny. I never know what's gonna come out of my throat. This has been a Cartoon Moxie video. T&W Studios.